Please adhere to YouTube's selected guidelines before viewing content of this video. I do not encourage or condone any products, actions, or behaviors shown in this video. All videos are produced in a safe, professional, and controlled environment. Please do not attempt to replicate any actions performed during the video. All actions are performed by professionals. Alrighty, so today I'm going to be going to a smoking cafe in Harajuku, which is in Tokyo, Japan. Smoking cafes don't really exist in the United States, at least not in the form they do here in Japan, because in the United States, unless it's a like 100% adult only facility, you cannot smoke inside basically anywhere. That's just the law and it really does suck. But it's not that way in Japan. Indoor smoking laws have gotten a little bit more stringent in Japan over the last couple years or so, but there are still some cafes which you are allowed to smoke inside. And today I'm gonna go to one of them, which honestly I am very excited to do. I haven't gone to any smoking cafes yet, so I am just so excited to have the opportunity to go to one today. They don't look like they're, they, they have any food that I can eat or anything like that kind of thing. I've got some allergies and I don't think I can eat any of their food, but they do have black tea, and I'm a pretty big fan of black tea. Hopefully it's Earl Grey. I don't know though, but either way, I'll take black tea, you know what I'm saying? And I'll smoke a couple cigarettes while I'm enjoying my black tea, that is for sure. Certainly no complaints on my behalf, but the place should be coming up just over here. Let's see, where is it? Here we go, here it is. So you're not allowed to enter unless you're over 20. And let's go ahead and go inside. Sam, there we go, cool. This place is called Lighters. Konnichiwa. Smoking? Yes. Thanks. Are we going to talk Ah, thank you. So I think I already know what I want. I think I want the black tea. And I'm going to start smoking in just a moment. But I think I'm going to just point at this and just point at the hot one. I'll go and show you all the menu real quick. But I'm going for that one right there. I was a little bit awkward. I didn't know if I was supposed to sit down or order at the bar, but it is what it is kind of thing. Either way though, very hyped to be able to smoke in this cafe right here. Everybody else is smoking. It's a good time, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go and get one of my smokes all lit up though. This is actually, oh no. I thought it was my last piece for the snow. Though. It feels so weird to be able to smoke inside like a cafe, but it's so nice, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. And their ashtrays are very nice, if I do say so myself. Big fan of their ashtrays. So you can get alcohol here too. I'm not going for any of that though. I think I'm gonna just go for some uh, black tea. I think that's uh, right up my alley at the moment. I just ate a very large meal at a restaurant and uh, definitely need some caffeine. Food wipe me out. But the food here looks great, I ain't gonna lie on. Yeah, I had no clue how this uh, cafe works. I didn't even know if this, uh, if this table was open. I thought I just ordered it at the bar, like uh, a lot of cafes in the United States, but now you sit down. There you go. I think I know what I want. So I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to wave her over. I don't know if she just comes back or I'm supposed to wave her over. I have no clue. We'll find out. These piece though, absolutely amazing. Very enjoyable. <laughs> don't wanna get too far ahead of myself though. I've still got my tea to get, and I've still got to smoke a cigarette when I'm drinking my tea. I know this place is pretty nice. Ooh, uh, hot? Hot. Tea? Yeah. Tea? Yeah. Yes. Okay. No, no cream? No cream. No, no cream. sugar. No sugar. Yes. Thank you very much. There we go. That's just how I take it. Black tea, no sugar, no cream. That's what I'd that's, that's be going for, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully lots of caffeine, right? Hopefully lots of caffeine. So glad to be here right now. 
this stuff, this sort of stuff doesn't exist in the U.S. in pretty much any facet. And if you're going to go to a cafe and smoke, you got to go outside kind of thing. But I'm inside right now. Granted, I'm right near the door, but I'm still inside right now. And it's just absolutely crazy that I can smoke inside, get myself a cup of tea, warm up a little bit, and then go back out and continue what I'm doing. It's so damn nice. And I haven't been to a smoking cafe yet. And I'm thinking this is already going to be a really good experience. So I'm definitely going to have to come back to one in the future, if not this specific one, if I'm in the area again. Although there apparently are a decent amount of smoking cafes around. Um, apparently they exist to a pretty large extent. Apparently Starbucks used to let you smoke, um, I think, on the patio. I don't think they ever let you smoke inside, but apparently when they got rid of that, a lot of cafes started getting rid of smoking as well. Starbucks was the trendsetter for that, apparently. And uh, that, that's just this is just what I've heard online, so take what I say with a grain of salt. But apparently Starbucks was a trendsetter. You can still find smoking cafes, of course, but they are specifically smoking cafes. They aren't just cafes you can smoke at anymore. I don't know if I'm gonna have another piece. I mean, like, my piece, please. I've been really enjoying them over the last couple days. Uh, my opinion on them, now that I'm almost done with the pack, has changed a little bit. Uh, so I might have to uh, figure that out fully once I finish off the pack, but I'm thinking I might smoke something a little bit lighter while I'm actually drinking my tea because this has uh, 1.9 1. 1. milligrams of nicotine in it. And let me tell y'all what, when I smoke my first cigarette of the day and it's a piece, I'm on my ass. I, I can't even finish the cigarette. It's just so intense. And uh, so I think, I think I might have a slightly less intense, I think I might have a slightly less intense cigarette when I'm there. enjoying my tea, that is for sure. So just looking around as well, it looks like they actually sell like rolling tobacco here. I don't know if they actually sell cigarettes, but it looks like they have snuff and rolling tobacco, uh, which is pretty cool if I do say so myself. You guys see cigars, they sell, it looks like uh, they have snuff. Yeah, damn. I see everything but cigarettes, I think. I don't think they sell raw packs of cigarettes. But either way though, I wouldn't be surprised if in the back they do, but I, 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 I'm not sure, I'm not sure. Either way though, certainly can't complain. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, this looks very good. It's gonna, ooh, very hot. I'm going to let that cool for a moment. While I'm doing that, I'm going to go ahead and get one of my other cigarettes out. I also have my pack of highlights with me today. I haven't smoked my way through the highlights yet. So looking forward to uh, having one of these. They're a little bit lighter. 1.4 milligrams of nicotine compared to 1.9. So not much lighter, but a little bit lighter nonetheless. So. I definitely do think that uh, these might be more to my preference right now when I'm just trying to chill a little bit. I could go for something with like less than a gram of, less than a milligram of nicotine though. Uh, at the moment though, I'm gonna lie to y'all, man. The piece, the piece original filters are so intense. So good, but so intense. But man, I'm looking forward to this tea. This tea looks absolutely amazing, I'm gonna lie to y'all. It really does just look so good. All right, look at that. Look at that. You can't beat that tea, you know what I'm saying? You can't beat that tea. It just looks, Absolutely delicious. Still very, very, very hot, I will admit. There's some boiling tea. It smells really, really good. It really does smell so good. I'm looking forward to having it. Once it cools down, it's still so warm. This tea is still so hot. It's getting to the point where I think I can drink it now though. So I think I'm gonna give it one more moment and then I'm gonna go ahead and drink some. Let's see how it is though. Let's see if I can drink it. It's still a little bit warm, but very interest, in interesting. Very interesting taste. I'm not sure if it's all right. I'm not sure. I don't think it is. I don't think it's English breakfast either. It might be Earl Grey. I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to take another sip to know for sure. 
I still have no clue. I still have no clue. I'm not that much of a tea connoisseur. I enjoy my Earl Grey every single morning, but I'm not a tea connoisseur. That is good though. That is really good. Just stubbed out my cigarette for the moment. I think I'm chilling right now. I am, uh, I'm pretty buzzed right now. I'm pretty buzzed right now. So I think I'm just gonna be chilling just for the moment. But this tea is so good though. Just gonna let my buzz dissipate a little bit. And then I think I'm gonna get another cigarette all it up, finish off my tea, head out of here after I pay, of course. I know I said I was gonna get another cigarette all lit up, but man, I'm just chilling now. I really am just chilling. This cup of tea was like four and a half bucks. It's a little bit pricey. 600 yen. But I mean like, hey, can't complain. It's worth it for the experience, you know what I'm saying? I think I'm gonna go and get another cigarette all lit up though. That was really good. I cannot complain, y'all. I'm really buzzed right now. I don't typically smoke three over one milligram cigarettes back to back. That is for sure, that is for sure. Not usually what I do. Well then, I think I'm gonna go and take a couple more hits of my cigarette, and then I think after that, I'm gonna go ahead and pay and get out of here and do my outro. I'm really buzzed right now, but uh, I know if I don't move now, I'm never gonna move, so I might as well go ahead and finish off my cigarette and go ahead and get moving, you know what I'm saying? And I think that was it for me. I think that was it for me. And I'm all good. I'm very buzzed right now, y'all. This has been a lot of fun, though. I'm so glad to have had the opportunity to go to a smoking cafe in Japan. It's so cool. Alrighty though, y'all. It is time for me to get out of here. Alrighty though, I'm gonna go and pay. We have been outside this man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Alrighty though, y'all, certainly cannot complain. That was a very fun experience. I feel like I almost fell asleep in there. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Man, oh man, wow. I am still quite buzzed right now. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. But I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching me go to a smoking cafe in Harajuku, which is in Tokyo, Japan. I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video. If you guys have enjoyed watching this video where I, well, went to a smoking cafe in Japan, certainly make sure to like and subscribe for more content. I have my Instagram, my book, my merch, my PO box, and my, excuse me, uh, second channel all in the description down below. Go check it all out. But yeah, thank you very much for watching y'all. To the next one, stay safe and peace and have a great one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying.